So you're here, like, are you feeling anything now? Yeah, so it's crazy because when I look out into the audience, like, all I see and hear is dead people. Like, I feel like I'm connecting. <laughs> oh my I God, it's like the movie, Six Sense, you're that boy. It is, like, I feel like I'm connecting with, like, the funeral home because all of these souls that are here, you know, trying to speak and trying to connect. And first of all, your mom departed. Your mom's standing right next to you. Can I get up? What, what? Your mother's right here. The way that it works for me is that when I'm in a room or I'm in, a, in, in an area, all of your souls will try to come through and speak. And she was just standing next to you and saying, that's my daughter, that's my daughter. So know it's your mom's way of just acknowledging that you're here and letting you know that she is OK. This was a woman who had suffered before her passing here in the physical world. Because yes. what happens is, Kelly, is that they'll put me back in their body to show me what had gone on. And they'll stand next to you to show you that here. And she showed me she couldn't breathe before she had passed. Yes. She says, but I'm in the lighter. I feel like I'm, what, like I'm drowning when I'm connected what? to her. <laughs> yeah, she had a heart attack. I was in the emergency room. Um, she was 62 years old. Your That's mom says nice. to me that, first of all, she wants to thank you for keeping a promise to her. She says, you promised to her that you weren't going to leave her side because she was afraid. She says, and you know that my daughter stayed with me all night long, and you laid on the side of her, and you laid with her, and your mom just wants to say, thank you so much for allowing my soul to go the other side. Yeah. Can I give you a hug? Yeah. <laughs> she also... She also says, when I'm connecting with her, that you feel her all the time. Because she shows me that she's in the house with you, and like you talk with her, and your mom says, I hear everything that you do. She says, so thank you for laying with me, staying with me, and making my journey to the other side OK. She says, because I couldn't have done it without you. She says, and thank you for respecting my wishes. Mm -hmm. Right? Give her a round of applause. Wow. So wait, I have a question. Yes. I mean, so wait, you can come over here, because I want to oh, ask you, you this. Because like you just brought up the journey afterwards, right? So. Do a lot of people ask you, oh, sorry, I wait to sit but wait, do a lot, oh, I'm so sorry. Oh, that's do okay. a lot of people ask you like what happens like after people pass, like after they die? Or, or I will, <laughs> what happens? <laughs> I don't know if others do, but do you, I mean, because if you see them, like what do you think happens when we die? So what happens is, is that when you first pass on, because I read for a lot of people, and their loved ones will come through and tell me what happens afterwards. And when you first pass on, or when you first go to the other side, you're immediately greeted by family members that had passed. Family members, pets, people that had passed on, they're all there. It's literally like one big family reunion on the other side. OK, well, thank you for That was incredible. And <laughs> I am <laughs> mind blown <laughs> that you even knew all those details is so creepy and awesome. <laughs> um, I am so glad I don't see dead people, though. So please, dead people, if you're in the room, <laughs> I can't handle it, <laughs> like, just so you know. <laughs> Subscribe to my channel. Subscribe to my channel. Subscribe to my channel. Subscribe to my channel. Please don't make me keep going.